everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's Primark haul is a massive one, by the way. I kind of went a little bit crazy this month. So today is actually the 1st of July, it's a Sunday, and this morning I have been shopping in Primark. So this is completely fresh. This is what's available from the 1st of July. I must say this month is pretty incredible. They have some amazing things in there. If you're new to this channel, please give me a subscribe. I do uh, Primark videos every single month and I also have one coming up on Wednesday. So subscribe if you don't want to miss that. So before I jump into the whole Primark thing, um, I'm going to open up four pieces of clothing that I received from Taliva. Now I do this um, at the beginning of pretty much every single Primark haul just because I like to find online alternatives to Primark. So meaning that clothing online which is the same price as Primark because there is no Primark online which I stress needs to happen one day. Right, okay, I'm just gonna jump into the first outfit because I did get some really nice things this month. So first up, I'm gonna start with this pink little summer dress. I got it in the size small and I believe it was only eight pounds, which is so cheap. It's just a really cute dress. I imagine myself wearing this if the family are coming over for a barbecue and I just wanna pop on something a little bit comfortable. So it has little poppers on the front so you can loosen them if you want to. And the color, you know I love pink and dusky pink and everything that's just pink and rose gold really. So this dress, I think it's really sweet and it's in the size small and like I said, it was only eight pounds. This next dress was only 12 pounds 42 to be precise and I am so in love with it. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Look at the print. It's just so nice. The material always feels quite good from Taliva despite it being really, really cheap. So this I think is the perfect Again, like picnic or barbecue dress, but if you wanna like dress up a little, you can definitely wear it with sandals or with heels, but I love the buttons as well. They have like silver little dainty buttons on the front, and they also have pockets. I love a good pocket because you can put your phone in there. A couple of years ago, I used to be a blazer wearer, but recently I just haven't been wearing blazers for some reason, but when I was looking through Taliva, I actually quite liked this green, blazer now they do have other colors i believe they also got a spotty one as well and it was only 13 pounds so i thought i would uh give it a go again to see if i can fall in love with blazers now it does have slight shoulder pads in there not like too stiff it's quite quite loose but it looks like it will give it like a really good frame as well and again the quality feels really good i think it feels a little bit better than primark not gonna lie. Then finally, I bought a jumpsuit. Now this was a wild card because I wasn't quite sure on the design, but I've opened it before this video and I actually quite like it. It was only like 15 pounds, so again, fairly cheap. Now it did say on the internet that it was gray, but it almost looks quite lilac-y. I don't know if you guys agree, but it's not quite gray, it's like lilac -y. Is that even a word, lilac -y? So at the back, you've got a little button and you've also got a zip. Now, with the sleeves, you do have these cutouts, which I think is really different. Um, I, I do like it. I mean, I'm not overly loving it, but it's not bad. For wildcard, it's pretty good. So I'll leave the link to everything down in the description so you guys can go and check out Taliva. Um, I just think it's a really good online version of Primark, so that's why I thought I'd mention it in this video. Okay, right, let's get on to Primark. So this month, I did get two massive bagfuls, so I wasn't lying when I said that I went a little bit crazy this month. We'll start with this bag. Oh, before I go into the bags, actually, I'm actually wearing one of the tops uh, that I bought from Primark this morning, and it was only four pounds. Now, just a little tip, um, I actually picked off the rail with a size eight hanger, but it's actually a size 12, which is so annoying. I don't understand why people can't just put the right size clothing on the right hanger. It just it blows my mind. Anyway, I paired it with these really cute denim shorts. Now, Primark have gone all rainbow at the moment, so you can see a lot of rainbow colors in support of Pride. There are so many gorgeous items. So I picked up these denim shorts and they've got the multicolored stripe. I love the color of denim as well. And these were only eight pounds. Yep, eight pounds. Talking 
of rainbow things. I'm just gonna go through the rainbow stuff I have first. So this next item was eight pounds and it's a crop jumper. Now I always think the quality of jumpers in Primark is really good. I am absolutely loving how they've popped the stripes on this top. I'm not overly keen on a overly striped multicolored top. I'm just I'm just not. And I just think this is really tasteful in fact. I also got these trousers as well, which for me is actually quite daring. So uh, here we go. These stripy trousers and I have to stress, they are the most comfortable trousers I have ever worn. You can wear them pretty high waisted as well and wear like a little crop tee. Now these were only 13 pounds, which I think is really good value for these because they are that comfortable. Have I mentioned that they're comfortable? I've said it like a million times. By the way, on Wednesday, I'm actually popping up a what's new in Primark video. So you can basically see everything that's new. Even if I've not like got every single rainbow piece that Primark have to offer, I am basically taking you through it on Wednesday. So don't stress. Next item from the rainbow range are these trousers again so these are in color green and they were only 10 pounds yep 10 pounds now what i like about these is that it has the little tie at the front i think that's really like in fashion at the moment and every time a girl is wearing a pair of trousers like this i'm a bit like i want a pair so i got a pair this time uh yeah they've got all different colors i think they had an orange pair or a mustard pair i think they had definitely had a mustard pair but i just thought green won it for me this time. Of course, every time I go into Primark, I pick up a little tea top, always. Like, I wear them to bed, and I also just, like, pair them with a skirt, shorts, anything, really. So, I got this little stripy little tank top. It actually is cropped, actually, which I'm, I'm not usually a cropped person, but I'm kind of feeling the whole high-waisted and cropped top. But this was only four pounds. So I also got another little crop tee and that was four pounds as well. I just like got different colors just in case, I don't know, I needed a pink, orange, yellow and blue one. Primark also have a load of socks in there at the moment. I feel like they've gone sock crazy recently. So I picked up these little white socks with the pink, yellow, and blue stripe on them, and they were only £1.50. I've left the best thing till last because I love this next item. When I was in there this morning, I pretty much got the last size eight and I felt really good about myself. It's really annoying when you go into Primark and your size isn't there. I almost feel really upset, not gonna lie. So it's this beautiful wrap dress now what i love about this dress is that you can wear it full length at the sleeve or you can kind of like push it up so it's like three quarter so if you're cold you can put the sleeve down if you're a bit hot you can roll it back up i'm not quite sure why i like this dress if i'm honest with you i don't like multicolored stuff usually as in like a stripy top which is all multicolors but i don't know i i think it's because the stripes are going down on this one I think that's why I like it. It's so comfortable. It's amazing for like going out or just pairing it with a pair of sandals and just wearing it casually. It's such a good dress. It also feels really soft as well. And how much was it? I think it was a bit more expensive. It was £20, but it's worth the £20, I feel. Okay, so bag one is down. Let's go on to bag two. Oh, I've also got another rainbow thing in bag two, and it's this weekend top now this was in the trending section and again it's got the different colored letters on that i just picked this up because i thought it'd be like a good top to throw on if i'm getting burnt shoulders or something in the sun this next item is super cute so it cost me five pounds and it's a pair of shorts with little pineapples on them and i actually got this from the love island range they have in there at the moment the quality feels great i always wear these to bed or just like outside in my garden and the color is fabulous this next item i just have to get because when i like put it against myself in the shop i was like that goes with my hair colour, so I'm gonna get it. So I picked up this rather gorgeous 
little jumpsuits. Now, usually I don't get tops like this. I don't really know why. I just I just don't. But I, this one looked really good for some reason. Now, I picked this up for £13. It's got a little tie as well around the waist, which I also like. But you can always take it off and put a belt on if you want to. And it's also got a loose leg. I thought that I'd probably wear this to a party or something this month like a good garden one. This next dress I actually thought was quite sophisticated and it's this little gorgeous dress and it's got a frill little neckline and also frills on the sleeve. Now this was 13 pounds, I adore the color and I thought it would look really good with my Gucci belt that I recently purchased and I reckon this would be great to go into meetings, I don't know, or just go into dinner or something. I just think it could be really cute as a casual dress and you can superly dress it up with a belt. If you guys are a massive fan of Kate Middleton, this next dress totally reminds me of when she left the um, hospital with Charlotte. Was she wearing, no, she was wearing yellow. I have to Google that, I might be wrong. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I think what I'm referring this to is when Kate Middleton left the hospital with George. She wore that really gorgeous blue spotted dress, but this, Imagine if it, imagine if it was blue. I think they actually did have a blue one in there. But I picked up the pink one because I like pink. Anyway, um, it does remind me of that dress she wore. They definitely did have a blue one in there. So if you want like a dupe of that dress, go to Primark because they have it at the moment. And I have been on the hunt for a good pink spotted dress for such a long time now. And I finally have found it and it's adorable. It also has a little tie as well and it kind of feels quite chiffony but not like not too chiffon if that makes sense i think this is gorgeous it also has like a slight frill on the ends and i just think it looks really lovely i think we're down to the last item you know so for the last item i picked up this bag i love the color the color is just insane and i also like the dragonfly on the front and it also can be a, like a little clutch or you can um unleash the little strap and have it as a shoulder bag. I'm very impressed with this bag. It's really good for Primark, I think. There we go, everyone. So that is everything I bought from Primark this month. Don't forget that on Wednesday, I'm actually doing a what's new in July video. So I'm gonna take you through everything that's new in Primark. So definitely hit the subscribe button if you wanna catch that video. I actually really like everything that I got this month. I got a lot of things. I'm not even going on holiday, but they just had so much variety in there definitely go and visit the bristol store because the bristol store is pretty epic anyway guys i'm gonna leave it there but thank you for watching go and check me out on instagram my link is down in the description and also the link to all the clothing at the beginning of this video is also down in the description as well but as always guys just make sure that you link like and subscribe and i'll see you next time for another video goodbye